Hello everybody, this is the Daydreamer with Daydreams and Nightmares, and this is going to be my video entry into El Hombre Gordo's 247 subscriber giveaway. Yes, he decided to do it at 247. Why not? Wait, wait till 250. For his giveaway, he's asking that you make a video. Actually, I don't think you need to make a video. You get more entries if you do a video. Anyway, he's asking you to answer five questions. For those five questions for his giveaway, he wants to know who is your favorite YouTuber? And I'm not sure I want to answer this question. Or how about if I answer El Hombre Gordo 1 is my favorite YouTuber? This is a dangerous slope as far as answering a lot of people on YouTube. Uh, are either going to hate you for not saying it was them or for somebody else or for... Uh, well, here's part of the problem too. Um, I like certain people that are in the Bluetooth community. I like certain people that are in the uh, booktube community. I like people that are in the comic community. I like people that are in the boxing unboxing community. I like people that are in the comic community. I like people that are in the uh, let's eat some food. I like some people that are in the let's play category. There's all kinds of variety here on YouTube, and that's the great thing about YouTube. But the problem is, is if you can't narrow it down to just just one person over here that I like because of what they do because they don't do what this other person does so I think it's very difficult to uh, pick a favorite in that direction um, but I can answer number two easily uh, favorite YouTube guilty pleasure um, I like watching um, I love I love music and and I like watching those uh, singing competitions uh, the the voice and and uh, who's got talent and X Factor and I like the fact that they narrow it down on YouTube where you only have to watch their performance instead of all the extra stuff that goes around it in creating a show. Um, so I pop in every once in a while and watch some of the the uh, good ones and bad ones, uh, and I find that to be a guilty pleasure, I guess, on on YouTube. Um, number three. What is your favorite childhood toy? Somebody recently asked me this in another video. Um, I grew up in the late 70s, early 80s, and uh, this is right around the time that the Star Wars movie came out. And I remember having a Millennium Falcon uh, toy. Um, and it had an opening hatch, and it had a gunnery area, and you could put your little action figures inside of it. and. Um, it, I said the, the fact that he had uh, asked me about that and I remembered it. I actually went to an antique store this last weekend and they had three of them in the shop. They were selling these things for 250 bucks a piece. I just I, I wish I still had the toy that I had when I was growing up as a kid. Um, number four, what is your favorite British TV show? This should come as absolutely no shock. El Hombre, El Hombre Gordo 1, but my favorite British TV show is Doctor Who. Uh, I've been watching it all my life. I've enjoyed watching Doctor Who from uh, from back in the time of uh, John Pertwee when I was really young, all the way up until Peter Capaldi is playing him now. But how about if I give you a few others I enjoy watching? Uh, I also, during that period of time, uh, when I was growing up, we also were able to watch, and I loved watching, uh, The Avengers uh, with um, Emma Peel and, oh, I'm having a brain dead moment right now. I'm sure you'll be able to tell me. Uh, it was Emma, it was uh, John Steed, there we go, that's what his name is. John Steed and Emma Peel in The Avengers. And also, um, that was the height of uh, Monty Python's Flying Circus. Absolutely hilarious and fun to watch. Uh, more modern shows that I've enjoyed watching are along the lines of like uh, Primeval, uh, mixing dinosaurs with modern times. Wonderful show. Uh, let's see, what else have I enjoyed? Sherlock, I've really enjoyed watching. Um, Every once in a while, I've managed to catch uh, on YouTube some Graham Norton, uh, which is pretty comparable to like our night, late night talk shows here. I've really enjoyed watching that as well. Uh, we talk modern uh, comedy. Uh, Little Britain is actually fairly funny uh, and fun to watch. Um, being Human, 
which just recently was made, well, not recently, uh, was is another one of those shows that started over in England and they made a U.S. version of it because it was that good. Um, I hope that answers all those questions because I can't answer number five either because I really don't watch any podcasts. Um, can't think of any that I, I, that I actually watch, um, so I don't really have a favorite podcast. Anyway, go check out El Bom- El. I'm trying to say El Hombre Gordo 1's 247 giveaway. I will leave the information in the description down below. Go check out his channel and his giveaway. And thank you for watching.